That's exactly right, Dave. The crime scene tape still up here tonight. Just down the road, investigators have spent hours pouring over every inch of that home where that little boy was murdered. We now know his name. It's Zion, a three-year-old. Little Zion was brutally murdered, stabbed to death multiple times inside his house. He was only three years old. Relatives say his mother was not responding to their calls, so they alerted police. Relatives went to the location uh, after uh, not receiving uh, a response over the telephone and at the door from the mother and uh, someone who had a key let the police in. Police found Little Zion unresponsive inside the home and declared him dead at the scene. Turn. Turn. While police and canine units combed over the scene for a murder weapon, a task force of agents from multiple law enforcement agencies tracked down and took Zion's mom into custody. Police would not say where she was located or if she's cooperating with the homicide investigation. This neighbor says she saw Zion in a stroller with his mother on several occasions. The child was innocent. It had nothing to do with this or whatever. Whatever the circumstance was, that child did not deserve to die. And back out here live, relatives say Zion's mother has a history with mental health issues. We were scheduled to talk with the family tonight. They canceled at the last moment. They were just too overwhelmed with grief. As you can imagine, Zion would have turned four in August. Live in Inkster, I'm Rudy Harper, 7 Action News.